Hi, welcome back to Traveling Cat Photos. I'm Kat, and if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, or at least the like button, and let YouTube know you're enjoying what you're seeing. And what you're seeing right now is the gorgeous Monterey Bay. Right behind us, that is Lover's Point. We're gonna go around Ocean View Boulevard and share with you some of the views today on this gorgeous Monterey Blue Day. We are celebrating our 34th wedding anniversary today. So we're gonna go to the Fishwife for lunch, check out the butterflies at the Butterfly Grove, and see what the beginning of that migration looks like. And then we're gonna head out to the murals in Seaside and see the newest additions that they just added this year. So let's hit the road. The Monterey Bay is rich with wildlife. Many different types of birds are easily seen from the shoreline. In fact, this great blue heron just sort of followed us along the walking path. This could be good for me. Lately I was feeling like I need a purpose. But when you talk to me, give me the impression that I won't scratch your surface. For days, searching for your brain. The Fishwife is an older restaurant, but the food is gourmet and seriously, seriously good. Lost in your maze, stuck in your gaze. How can I get out? I'm out of time to make you mine. Baby, show me how. The Butterfly Grove is very accessible. Level pathways wind down to the bottom of the grove, so keep in mind as you're going down that you're going to need to take that path back up again. Fortunately, you don't have to go far to see the butterflies each year as they're usually towards the beginning of the path. It is just amazing to see the monarchs clustered together in little hive-shaped groups. If you don't look carefully the first time you go, you may just think they're leaves on the trees. Every year we come out to the grove hoping to see the butterflies. The migration the last few years has been rather sad, declining every single year. But this year to see such high numbers has been heartwarming. We hope you've enjoyed this little bit. If you're in town, somewhere near Monterey, Pacific Grove, the Pismo Beach, or even the Santa Cruz area, there are groves there for the monarchs every year between about the middle of November to the middle of January. It's worth a stop. So as you can see, there are lots of butterflies already in the grove. From about 1,500 two years ago to I think they counted two last year, this is a really good sign. We found this little deer family near the golf course, just blocks from the grove. You can easily find deer in this area any time of the year. Harbor Seal Splash is part of their mating ritual. He's showing off with a girl. Early last season, we did a whole video on the Sand City murals. I'll link that video up in the right hand corner if you missed it. They have added so many really cool pieces in 2021. 
that we couldn't wait to go back and we were just blown away. My absolute favorite is this one featuring the wildlife in our area. Each section is gorgeous, but all together, this piece is just stunning. And all of this great art is free to go see. In fact, everything we did today, with the exception of lunch, was totally free. The Monterey Bay area has a lot to offer without you having to spend a dime. This was early November and fall, winter is a great time to visit. We do have some periods of rain, but usually the weather is clear and blue and gorgeous, unlike early summer when we're dealing with June gloom. We had a great time celebrating our 34th anniversary. Make sure you subscribe so you can see how we're celebrating our 35th all year long. Keep traveling and we'll see you next time.